Hey everyone, it's Aaron with Hale Varsity. I'm joined by Drake, also Hale Varsity, and we are here inside Memorial Stadium following another Nebraska football practice. And as you can see behind us, the band is back practicing. So fair warning, you may hear the band from time to time. So we will keep this update quick because we have plenty to come at HaleVarsity.com. But Drake, let's just get started. What were the big topics that you heard today from, we heard from Mark Whipple, Rayola, Applewhite, and a couple of players. What did we hear? Yeah, so we did hear from Donovan Rayola today, and that was nice. And he talked about the offensive line and just how he feels good about it. He's often bringing it back to a team perspective rather than wanting to talk about just one guy. Uh, so he feels good about where his line's at. Um, I also spent time listening to Ramir Johnson and Ativa Maga Clemens. Uh, they're both, you know, versatile players. Uh, Clemens was a defensive back in high school and even in part of junior college. And he's made that switch to linebacker, and he feels good about it. He's trying to make his push for um, playing time this year. And Ramir is taking on more of a he called it the wide back position where he's both a running back and receiver and he feels good about that versatility. Yeah, and I, I was standing over and listening to Turner for a little bit and Turner actually spoke about, ooh, so windy, um, pretty breezy inside Memorial. Look, you can just tell. Um, Turner was actually talking a little bit about um, just where he's been playing. He has moved from tackle to guard as we know and that's a pretty like, that's pretty much set in stone. Although he was being kind of coy, they all were. They all were being kind of coy about like, who's starting and where and everything else we can kind of like obviously make some deductions based on what we've been hearing but I mean even even Whipple was asked who the starting quarterback is and he said that's a that's a question for the head coach that his that's his decision essentially so they're all doing that good job of playing coy now I did also ask Turner about the adjustment to getting ready to play overseas Ireland is six hours ahead of central time zone. So they've been asking, so Scott Frost has been asking the players to head to bed earlier, get up earlier. They're trying to make that adjustment now. So heard that from a couple of the players, um, specifically Turner is one of the ones I asked and he talked about. So, I mean, we'll kind of just see how it goes uh, when they get there. They'll have, they leave on Monday, they have an acclimation day on Tuesday, and then they're kind of like in full swing getting ready for the game. Did anyone else talk about kind of like just season expectations, getting ready for Northwestern? I know they've switched into Northwestern prep. So was there any kind of discussion on just general prep? Yeah, uh, not too much, but, you know, they're all ready. They all feel good about the schedule. Uh, they're ready to go over to Ireland and get the season started. Yeah, I, I think that's kind of the general, like even Rayola, like you can watch all of these videos at HaleVarsity.com, or excuse me, they will be on HaleVarsity.com, but you can watch these videos on our YouTube channel as well. And Rayola was pretty much like short, sweet, wanted to get back to work. You could tell he was like, I'm, I'm here to just answer questions and head back to get, get on with get on with my day. Because I do think that they're all really just ready to see a game week and get into an actual game scenario situation I did listen to a little bit of did you have a chance to listen to Apple White by chance I did not I caught you. okay I heard a little bit and kind of like he was he was reiterating a lot of what Whipple said which is that you know there's no starting running back at this time again playing coy probably to a degree but like the competition is still there they have about five running backs that they feel really good about and from there we'll see so Drake I leave for Ireland tomorrow. I leave tomorrow Friday. Uh, the team leaves Monday. You will be here on Sunday to hear everything. What is? What are some final thoughts as we get ready for an actual game week preparation? Yeah, I mean, I think just like everyone, I'm ready to see the season get started, and we're finally there. You know, we're a few days away from the team being in Ireland, and we'll have one last press conference uh, here before that happens. And they will have you completely covered from here at Memorial Stadium on Sunday. So be able to be sure to subscribe to Hill Varsity um, here on YouTube. Also, become a subscriber at HillVarsity.com. We really appreciate you. We appreciate you always chiming in. We understand that sometimes audio issues present themselves like when we have uh, a fun experience like the band behind us right now. But we appreciate you always uh, enjoying. And I do also appreciate the people who said, hey, could you two just step out of the way so we could watch the band practice? Look, I respect it. But we will be back with even more, like I said, on Sunday from the press conference. I will have you covered in Ireland with even more. Uh, so be sure, again, subscribe, 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 subscribe. Drake, thank you as always for your time and for helping out. Subscribe. That's the message. Talk to you later.